reaching for your phone instead of your wallet the next time you need your driver's license. One Pennsylvania representative is pushing to go high tech. Sarah Wilson joins us with the possibility of having a digital driver's license. Sarah. Alicia Valerie, mobile IDs are becoming more common across the country. A number of states have them, and now some want Pennsylvania to become one of them. It's happened to most of us before. You reach in your back pocket or purse to grab your ID out of your wallet, and it's not there. Frustrating, yes. That's why Representative Dan Miller says he has a solution for that. No ID holder required. Instead of just picking up their phone, but you'll have the ability to also have a digital driver's license at your fingertips. It's an idea Miller has proposed twice before. He's hoping this third time will be the charm. It's the reality and, and I think Pennsylvania should get on board. The ID would work almost exactly like a physical one. You could use it to buy alcohol or if you're stopped by the police. Using it to fly is another story. I believe at some point it will be used for everything the federal requires, uh, but I cannot speak to, uh, to the state of federal law. Miller says security wise, certain things would need to be worked out. And we don't want them to be um, uh, you know, sort of easily copied or, or altered in some way that would not allow for a, uh, an accurate identification. But Miller says the digital ID is the way of the future. He's hoping his colleagues and Governor Shapiro will feel that way too. They're looking for ways to move Pennsylvania forward in a variety of things. I think this fits that. But some Pennsylvanians are pumping the brakes on the proposal, which has yet to be formally introduced. Let's just save the time and the energy, uh, the resources for other things that are more important for, uh, for us to do in development of our own cities and infrastructures and where our tax dollars go, I guess. If this legislation does pass and you don't want a digital ID, you don't have to get one. Miller says no matter what, everyone will still have a physical copy. Valerie. Thank you, Sarah.